Okay, this segment is about the kitchen area. So it's a little more to explain. It's the most important place, I guess. All right, you can see this is an air freshener again on the third floor. I keep it all all the time on to keep the uh, kitchen area uh, air fresh. And here's the fire extinguisher, uh, keep it handy. And here is the central vac system here. All right, all you have to do is just uh, use this hose and then put it in the uh, sucking holes onto the wall, then um, the suction begins. I'll show you later on where the suction holes are. And here comes the uh, cabinet here. I suggest you can use my kitchen towels. I have a lot sitting here. Can save some, uh, 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 you know, the paper towels. But it's up to you, okay? You can just use it and wash it and whatever. Um, also comes to here, the stove. Now cleaning the um, uh, stove top, I have a special cleaners right here in the cabinet here, okay? It calls the uh, stove top cleaner, so you can use. Uh, if you finished up, you can just buy it online. It's very easy to buy. And then in the stove area, um, I have a warning sign, <laughs> kind of a notice in here. I really, really wish you would take this seriously. Um, that in the accidents does happen, people, you know, have the, something cooking here and then they went upstairs to their rooms and accidents happen. So I really, really strong suggest that don't do that, okay? If you have something cooking, stay with your, uh, with the stuff you're cooking. And also I have some supplies here you can welcome to use. To, um, uh, after you finish these supplies, um, then buy your own kinds, okay? And um, here comes to the sink and everything. Uh, okay, there are two switches in here, uh, which I put a tape on it, black tape on it. Don't turn it off. One is for the ender cabinet lights, and the other one is for the dishwasher. So if you, if you turn them off, then you turn on the lights or use the dishwasher, then the dishwasher would not work. So keep it on all the time, okay? And also come over here. Um, oh, here's a oh, used towel that I usually put in, in the entrance area. I have lots of them in the basement, so I can show it to you in the segment of the basement. Uh, I usually put it under uh, here that to protect from the water and moisture uh, you carry in from your shoes in the winter time, the snowy days and the rainy days. That can keep my beautiful hollow floor out of from water, water and moisture, which they really damage the floor, okay? I strongly suggest that you use that. Um, that'll be very, very useful. And also come over here, uh, we have the trash uh, portion of it. We have, in Cambridge, we have three kinds of uh, trash. One is regular, one is recycled, and one is compost. Uh, so we have three bins over here. One is regular, one is uh, uh, recycled. And then here's a little green bucket here is for the recycle. Uh, no, uh, for the compost, okay? And they all using different bags, okay? I try to not to use the plastic ones. Online, they are, you know, sell all kinds of biodegradable and the compost bags. So you should look into that and buy those to use. Uh, I suggest that. All right, uh, I think that's all I can think of. Uh... Oh, the security system right here by the uh, the door here. Uh, I suggest just leave it there and not to use it. Sometimes um, you can see there's a message come says the door's open or something. Usually it's the second floor leading to the deck. You probably didn't secure it very well. So, uh, so give you a message that you did not close it. But it's the second floor, I wouldn't really worry about that. You know, people, how they gonna come in, you know, uh, coming from the second second floor, the deck. Uh, but um, um, 
just leave it. I really don't use it at all. This is a safe neighborhood. I've lived here for 15 years and never had any bad incidents happen. So um, let's see what else. Oh, 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 here it is. The refrigerator service, okay. Now this uh, stainless steel is very fragile. I strongly suggest, and then please do not use the sponge, the hard surface to wipe the surface. It will leave the scratch mark. Use the soft part, just the water and uh, you don't even sometimes don't use the detergent. Just use the water and the soft part and then the and then the towel, kitchen towel to wipe it. And that should just take the, um, keep it nice and shine, okay? Um, all right, let's see what else on my list. Um, uh, I think that's about it. If I can think of something, I'll just add it later, okay? Thank you so much, bye.